Hello, I'm Roger here at Mercedes-Benz of Scarborough in Scarborough, Maine. Doing a video of this 2022 170 wheelbase 4x4 Tenorite Gray Metallic uh, Sprinter van. Um, this one now, LED headlights are very difficult to get. This van happens to have the LED headlights. Also, it has the chrome grille. Um, both things are a little tough to get right now. We were able to get them on this particular unit. It's got the fog lights. <clears throat> It's got the safety sensors in the bumper. <clears throat> and as you can see, this has a painted front bumper as well. It's not the big black plastic as uh, normal. <clears throat> and then we'll come around here to the passenger side. <clears throat> you can see right away too, it's got the uh, alloy wheels from Mercedes-Benz. Um, this van does in fact have the 360 degree camera as well. One of the cameras is out front under the three point star. And also you have a camera here underneath of the mirror and on the driver's side as well. <clears throat> and this actually, this van actually has the extra LED lighting too for the cargo compartment in the ceiling, which is really nice, gives you lots of light back here. And then we have the covering over the wheel wells. Also the side, side wall hardboard paneling. The wood floor with the anti-slip coating on it. Uh, just a really durable floor and then also this has the uh, has the door latch halfway so you can open the slider up just halfway this would be a beautiful Sprinter van to outfit to travel in as I said the 170 inch wheelbase so you have 14 feet 6 inches of floor space to use and then we'll come around to the back so we have a the nice backup camera just above the third brake light we got the nice uh, trailer hitch where you can tow a 5,000 pound trailer. And then this uh, Sprinter van also has the uh, doors. They'll latch in place 90 degrees and they open up 270. And they latch in place, just easy access in and out of the back of the van. Um, and as you can see, our hitch has the nice step right here too to get in and out of the back of the van very easily. <coughs> And then we'll come over here to the driver's side. <clears throat> we have our uh, fuel filler right here. 24 and a half gallon fuel tank. Very nice too that Mercedes-Benz had put diesel on the fuel cap because Mercedes does have gasoline models. We have the comfort seat package. So you have your adjustments here, lower lumbar. This jacks your seat up and down. We have, a, we have a nice uh, knob here for your seat back. Um, this also has the swivel seat package. So the seats uh, swivel right around very smoothly. Leatherette seating, very durable. Um, leg extender here too, too for folks that have uh, long legs. And then we have our uh, heated seat switch right here. This one does have a nice elbow pad here on the door as well is really nice. Um, so now folks we're going to hop inside the van and go over some features in here. All right so we're sitting here in the side the Tenorite Gray Metallic uh, 170 4x4 cargo. Uh, we'll start right up here. This has a beautiful uh, wireless charging tray up here in the center of the dash. We got a 112 volt uh, charging socket. We got the uh, USB port right here. These are C drive ports. So uh, this particular one, you can get your Apple CarPlay on this beautiful 10 and a quarter inch display screen, which is very hard to get. There was a major shortage of these uh, this past year and into this year, uh, but we were able to get this one. We can uh, pair two cell phones right here. Beautiful navigation system, and you can uh, shrink the screen and blow it up. <clears throat> And then this is all touchscreen and voice command. So you got your AM, FM uh, radio. We got a media center right here too. You can stream your music from your cell phone. We have a nice info center. Um, this will show your fuel consumption. This van only has like eight miles, eight or nine miles on it right now. So um, we don't have an accurate fuel economy rating. There's a nice app store you can utilize. Vehicle settings, so it has ESP, which is stability control, uh, Parktronics, it's got the lane tracking assist. 
Uh, it's got your uh, 360 degree camera, which is really nice. So you have several settings here. So there's uh, one of your cameras too for hooking up your trailer hitch. We have a nice backup camera, nice wide angle rear view, blind spot. Um, we have the passenger side door open right now. So you can't see the right hand side, but it'll give you your blind spot, your front view camera and a wide angle front view. Just very clear, uh, very nice, especially if you're in and out of tight spots. Uh, traffic sign, whoops, I got a, so you can see what the speed limits are. You can make it visual, which is really nice, visual and audible. Uh, visual is the one that most folks use. Uh, active lane keeping assist, which is on right now. It'll help track, keep you tracking in your lane. Uh, we have active brake assist right now. So when you have your cruise control on, you're going down the highway, the van's going to slow itself down on its own to prevent you from running into a vehicle in front of you. And then we have acoustic door locks. They'll lock on their own. You can mess around with that and set the settings. Uh, your light, lighting. Uh, systems, we can uh, set the uh, time and date. So it'll be in your time zone. Uh, just some nice features. Also, we can control that with a uh, mouse pad here on the right hand side of the steering wheel. And then on the left hand side, you have your cruise control um, and you can display uh, different items in your, in your uh, instrument panel, which is really nice. So if there's anyone out there looking for a beautiful 170 4x4 uh, Sprinter van, please give me a call. My name is Roger. My cell phone number is 207-838-0169. Thank you very much. Thank you.